The plane that crashed into a field in Louisiana, killing five people on board, was headed to the Louisiana State Bowl game last night. Here's a look at the flames seen by witnesses after the crash. The plane was carrying six people. A 30-year-old sports reporter, a 15-year-old boy, two men, and a woman were killed. The sports reporter is the daughter-in-law of a coach for the Louisiana State football team. One of the men is an executive at a large IT company called Global Data Systems. And the lone survivor is the vice president of sales at that same company and is in critical condition this morning. Here's what a witness saw as the plane went down. It was tilted like that. It came, it came like it hit, the, it hit that post first, then it tipped to hit the, uh, the Suburban and came straight to hit that, that, that white Jeep. And then the plane flew, then the back of the tail flew right into the uh, thing. And then it went straight, and then the plane just blew up. What a dramatic scene. Officials say three people who were on the ground were also taken to the hospital. There was a moment of silence ahead of the New Orleans Pelicans game, and the New Orleans Saints have also issued a statement describing the loss as devastating.